my friends it's your old pal Jordan the lion and tonight we are going to experience part of creepy world days with Jordan the lion begins now this is brought to us by our friends that also make the darkness and the st. Louis escape rooms attractions I think he's went all out for this one as well Let's see what Larry's done <laughs> We are not going to do the whole thing because part of it they have actors for and this is not one of the nights the actors are here. Oh, check that out. This creepy pumpkin man up there cradling broken pumpkins. So without further ado, let's check out the pumpkin patch of Creepy World and some of the dead bodies in the coffins along the way kind of excited to see what this is all about because as far as I know I think this is the first year for what we're gonna see so I think this will be impressive because I was impressed with everything that I've seen of their attractions so far Creepy World's Jack-O-Lantern Spooktacular. Wow. Right now we're under the giant pumpkin. Oh wow. Look at this, holy cow. Now normally they have Halloween music like Thriller and Ghostbusters and all that stuff playing, but you know, we have problems with copyright, so. Look at that, we've got Simba the Lion King. Oh wow, Jim Morrison, that's a good one. They live! Psycho, Anthony Perkins. Look at all these great faces in there. Michael Myers. Oh man, that's great. Jesse James. Who's that? Who's that? I don't know that one. Not off the top of my head. Who is that? Was it Jim from The Office? That I think was Harry Potter before his nose broke off. Oh, that one's great. Another Michael Myers. Halloween. I probably shouldn't be going to each and ind individual one, but I figure if somebody put this much effort into making Beetlejuice and Elvira, we should feature it, right? Whoa! Oh my gosh, is that Manson? Kind of looks like it. Wow, look at all these. Oh man, is that Janet Lee? Wow, look at these. Martin Luther King, Batman, St. Louis Rams. <laughs> wow, that is very intricate. Oh, Marilyn. The headless jack-o'-lantern. God, they really did a fantastic job with all of these. And they're everywhere. I mean, look over here. My gosh. You have Jimi Hendrix. Uh-oh. One of, part of Elvis's mouth broke in. Hitchcock. Wow, looks like, uh, was that, that looks like that might have been Robert Pattinson, Hannibal Lecter, Bart Simpson. Oh wow, Edward Scissorhands, <laughs> Marty Feldman. 
the hand. And I saw some really good ones around here as well. Look at big boy. Brad Pitt. Oh yeah. He's a Missourian. Anthony Perkins again. Now look at these. These I really love because Grandpa Munster and the penguin. Oh my gosh. They absolutely killed it. Wow. Okay. Now we can move on. I'm sorry, I appreciate the artwork a little bit too much. When somebody goes through all the trouble of making, hand making a John Belushi pumpkin, you have to give it props. Whoa. Oh wow, <laughs> there's Jim Carrey. Oh, that's that horror nun movie. And if we turn around, we have the monsters. Look at that. Grandpa Herman. I don't know who that is. I don't know which monster that is. Is that Marilyn? <laughs> Lily and little Eddie. Okay. Oh, wow. All right. Whoa. Holy smoke. Ton. Oh my gosh. Wow. We have, wow. There's just a ton. More than you could ever possibly see. Man, you really gotta come check this out. I mean, they just, they went all out. So many of these pumpkins are famous faces. All right, oh wow. It's not like Nosferatu. And his creepy kids. You never know which ones are gonna move. Oh wow, look at that guy. And that guy. Look at this beast. Jeez, how many freaking pumpkins can you have? The whole like pumpkin hayride truck is completely full of famous pumpkins. From Ronald Reagan to Frankenstein to Bruce Lee. The leprechaun up there next to, it looks like Lou Brock. I'm okay with that. I think I would hate to be the guy to have to carve all these pumpkins though. Oh, that is cool. The eyes are going crazy up there. Like CGI eyes. And then Frank Sinatra. Freddy. Vincent Price, I love it. Speaking of St. Louis. 
Michael Jordan, Jason Voorhees, an insane looking multi-headed pumpkin man holding a kid by his ankles. Oh yeah. That, I think that's one of the coolest things I've seen so far. And then of course all of these pumpkins have faces. All right, let's go into the barn. pop open, I'm gonna freak out. Now they said they have like a hayride and um, multiple walkthrough experiences with actors. So not just this when you come here. That's horrifying. Look at all the pumpkin guts on there. You should be ashamed of yourself. You killed one of your own. Somebody's got to be the voice of reason here. Right, honey? A headless horseman. Skeleton horse. There's Elwood and Bela. Mars attacks. The birds. <laughs> oh, wow. Look at these little freaks. Oh man. Are you the guy that's been carving all the pumpkins? If this is your work, good job. You did a great Herman Munster. And they have a tractor back here. I think this is a uh, photo op maybe. They have Michael Myers. I was wondering if they would have Norman. I'm guessing when all the animatronics are on that these arms are going crazy. Let's go through these creepy gates. Looking for treats. He's 
got a treat for you. Listen to all that horror. Somebody's being tortured alive. I guess you'd have to be alive to be tortured, wouldn't you? <laughs> Creepy cornfield ladies. Oh, there's Marilyn Munster. I was wondering if we'd see a Marilyn Munster. And then when you come out, they have all kinds of these giant creatures that he's created to take photos with. Like, look at this. I love the inventions. Like all the characters they've invented here. Oh my God, look at that. Now we're gonna go in and check out the pumpkin barn. All right, this is the haunted left brewery. And go deep underground where no one can hear you scream. It's just down the street from the darkness. Learn more at lamphauntedhouse.com. Oh yeah, we got to do that another time. St. Louis Escape, downtown, nice. next door to the darkness. Nice little walk with through. Seven sixty-minute escape rooms, retro black light mini golf, and pinball arcade. Scarefest. Anybody else see that creepy cat creepy on the wall? Haunted house. So they kind of eliminated one of the uh, the pet peeves I have with going to haunted houses. Sometimes if you don't buy that expensive ticket, you wait forever. They show Beetlejuice up here. They have a license to actually show the movie Beetlejuice. That would definitely be a perk to standing in line. This place was pretty amazing. Just behave a little bit better than Jim Carrey did here. Doesn't that look like Jim Carrey they killed here? Don't mess around with the pig. So this is the Tomb of the Vampire experience. Like I said, there's multiple experiences here. We just did the one pumpkin patch today. And that, my friends, will do it for today. Happy Halloween, I hope you enjoyed this. If you're in the St. Louis area, don't be a stranger. Don't be scared. Have a great night and goodbye.